In astronomy, air mass, air mass or AM, is the path length for light rays from a celestial source to pass through the atmosphere. As it penetrates the atmosphere, light rays are attenuated by scattering and absorption. The thicker atmosphere through which it passes, the greater the attenuation. Consequently, celestial bodies when nearer the horizon appear less bright than when nearer the zenith. This attenuation, known as atmospheric extinction, is described quantitatively by the Beer-Lambert law. Air mass normally indicates relative air mass, the path length relative to that at the zenith at sea level. So, by definition, the sea level air mass at the zenith is one. Air mass increases as the angle between the source and the zenith increases, reaching a value of approximately 38 at the horizon. Air mass can be less than 1 at an elevation greater than sea level, however, most closed form expressions for air mass do not include the effects of elevation, so adjustment must usually be accomplished by other means. In some fields, such as solar energy and photovoltaics, air mass is indicated by the acronym AM. Additionally, the value of the air mass is often given by appending its value to AM, so that AM1 indicates an air mass of 1, AM2 indicates an air mass of 2, and so on. The region above Earth's atmosphere, where there is no atmospheric attenuation of solar radiation, is considered to have air mass zero. AM0. Tables of air mass have been published by numerous authors, including Bemperid, 1904, Allen, 1976, and Caston and Young. 1989. Topic. Calculating air masses Topic. Zenith angle and altitude The angle of a celestial body with the zenith is the zenith angle in astronomy, commonly referred to as the zenith distance. A body's angular position can also be given in terms of altitude, the angle above the geometric horizon, the altitude h and the zenith angle z are thus related by h equals 90 Minus z display style h equals 90 caret circ z topic atmospheric refraction atmospheric refraction causes light to follow an approximately circular path that is slightly longer than the geometric path, and the air mass must take into account the longer path Young 1994. Additionally, refraction causes a celestial body to appear higher above the horizon than it actually is, at the horizon, the difference between the True zenith angle and the apparent zenith angle is approximately 34 minutes of arc. Most air mass formulas are based on the apparent zenith angle, but some are based on the true zenith angle, so it is important to ensure that the correct value is used, especially near the horizon. Topic. Plain parallel atmosphere When the zenith angle is small to moderate, a good approximation is given by assuming a homogeneous plane parallel atmosphere i.e., one in which density is constant and Earth's curvature is ignored. The air mass x 
display style x then is simply the secant of the zenith angle z display style z x equals sec z display style x equals sec z at a zenith angle of 60 degrees the air mass is approximately 2 however because the earth is not flat this formula is only usable for zenith angles up to about 60 degrees to 75 degrees depending on accuracy requirements at greater zenith angles, the accuracy degrades rapidly, with x equals sec z. Display style x equals sec z, becoming infinite at the horizon. The horizon air mass in the more realistic spherical atmosphere is usually less than 40. Topic: Interpolative formulas. Many formulas have been developed to fit tabular values of air mass. One by Young and Irvine, 1967, included a simple corrective term: x equals sec z t. One minus zero point zero zero one two sec two Z T minus one Display style x equals sec z underscore mathrm t left one to zero point zero zero one two sec caret two z underscore mathrm t minus one right, where z t display style z underscore mathrm t is the true zenith angle. This gives usable results up to approximately 80 degrees, but the accuracy degrades rapidly at greater zenith angles. The calculated air mass reaches a maximum of 11.13 at 86.6 degrees, becomes zero at 88 degrees, and approaches negative infinity at the horizon. The plot of this formula on the accompanying graph includes a correction for atmospheric refraction so that the calculated air mass is for apparent rather than true zenith angle. Hardy introduced a polynomial in sec z minus 1 Display style sec z one x equals sec z minus zero point zero zero one eight one six seven sec z minus one minus 0.002875 sec z minus 1 2 minus 0.0008083 sec z minus 1 Three 
Display style x equals sec z zero point zero zero one eight one six seven sec z one zero point zero zero two eight seven five sec z one carrot two zero point zero 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 eight zero eight three sec z one carrot three which gives usable results for zenith angles of up to perhaps 85 degrees. As with the previous formula, the calculated air mass reaches a maximum, and then approaches negative infinity at the horizon. Rosenberg suggested x equals cos Z plus zero O two five E minus eleven cos Z minus one Display style x equals left cos z plus zero point zero two five e carrot minus eleven cos z right carrot minus one, which gives reasonable results for high zenith angles with a horizon air mass of forty. Caston and Young, nineteen eighty nine, developed x equals one. Cos Z plus zero point five zero five seven two six point zero seven nine nine five plus ninety minus Z minus one point six three six four Display style x equals frac 1 cos z plus 0 0.50572 6.07995 carat circ plus 90 carat circ z carat minus 1.6364, which gives reasonable results for zenith angles of up to 90 degrees with an air mass of approximately 38 at the horizon. Here the second z z term is in degrees. Young developed x equals 1.00232 Z T plus zero one hundred forty eight thousand three hundred eighty six cos Z T plus zero point zero zero nine six four six seven cos three Z T plus zero point one four nine eight six four cos two Z T plus zero point zero one zero two nine six three cos Z T plus Zero point zero 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 three zero three nine seven eight Display style x equals FRAC one point zero zero two four three two cos carrot two Z underscore mathem T plus zero point one four eight three eight six cos Z underscore mathem T plus zero point zero zero nine six four six seven cos carrot three Z underscore mathem T plus zero point one 
cos carrot two Z underscore Mathem T plus zero point zero one zero two nine six three cos Z underscore Mathem T plus zero point zero 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 three zero three nine seven eight in terms of the true zenith angle Z T display style Z underscore mathem T for which he claimed a maximum error at the horizon of 0.0037 air mass Pickering 2002 developed X equals one sin H plus two hundred forty four one hundred sixty five plus forty seven H one one Display style x equals frac 1 sin h plus 244 165 plus 47 h caret 1.1, where h display style h is apparent altitude 90 minus z. Display style ninety carat circ z in degrees. Pickering claimed his equation to have a tenth the error of Schaefer, nineteen ninety eight, near the horizon. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Atmospheric models. Interpolative formulas attempt to provide a good fit to tabular values of air mass using minimal computational overhead. The tabular values, however, must be determined from measurements or atmospheric models that derive from geometrical and physical considerations of Earth and its atmosphere. Topic: Non-refracting radially symmetrical atmosphere. If refraction is ignored, it can be shown from simple geometrical considerations. Schoenberg, 1929, 173, that the path S display style S of a light ray at zenith angle. Z display style Z through a radially symmetrical atmosphere of height y a t m display style y underscore mathrm a t m is given by s equals r e Two cos two Z plus two R E Y A T M plus Y A T M Two minus R E cos Z display style s equals sqrt r underscore mathrm e caret two cos caret two z plus two r underscore mathrm e y underscore mathrm atm plus y underscore mathrm atm caret two r underscore mathrm e cos z or alternatively s equals R E plus Y A 
T M two minus R E two sin two Z minus R E cos Z Display style S equals SQRT left R underscore mathem E plus Y underscore mathem ATM right carrot two R underscore mathem E carrot two sin carrot two Z R underscore mathem E cos Z where R E Display style R underscore mathem E is the radius of the earth topic <laughs> homogeneous atmosphere if the atmosphere is homogeneous ie density is constant the path at zenith is simply the atmospheric height y a t M display style y underscore mathrm atm and the relative air mass as x equals s y a t m equals r e y a T M cos two Z plus two Y A T M R E plus Y A T M R E two minus R E Y A T M cos Z Display style x equals frac s y underscore mathrm atm equals frac r underscore mathrm e y underscore mathrm atm sqrt cos caret two z plus two frac y underscore mathrm atm r underscore mathrm e plus left frac y underscore mathrm atm M R underscore mathem E right carrot two F R A C R underscore mathem E Y underscore mathem A T M cos Z If density is constant, hydrostatic considerations give the atmospheric height as Y A T M equals K T zero M G display style y underscore mathrm atm equals frac k t underscore zero M G where k display style k is Boltzmann's constant t zero Display style t underscore zero is the sea level temperature m. Display style m is the molecular mass of air and g. Display style g is the acceleration due to gravity. Although this is the same as the pressure scale height of an isothermal atmosphere, the implication is slightly different. 
In an isothermal atmosphere, 37% of the atmosphere is above the pressure scale height. In a homogeneous atmosphere, there is no atmosphere above the atmospheric height. Taking T zero display style T underscore zero equals two hundred eighty eight point one five K M display style M equals 28.9644 times 1.6605 times 10 minus 27 kilograms and G display style G equals 9.80665 meters per square second gives y a T M display style y underscore mathrm a T M approximately equals eight thousand four hundred thirty five meters. Using Earth's mean radius of six thousand three hundred seventy one kilometers, the sea level air mass at the horizon is x h o R I Z equals one plus two R E Y A T M approximately equals thirty eight point eight seven Display style x underscore mathrm Horus equals sqrt one plus two frac r underscore mathrm e y underscore mathrm atm approximately thirty eight point eight seven. The homogeneous spherical model slightly underestimates the rate of increase in air mass near the horizon. A reasonable overall fit to values determined from more rigorous models can be had by setting the air mass to match a value at a zenith angle less than 90 degrees. The air mass equation can be rearranged to give R E Y A T M equals X Two minus one two one minus x cos z Display style FRAC R underscore Mathem E Y underscore Mathem ATM equals FRAC x carrot two minus one two left one x cos Z right matching Bemperad's value of nineteen point seven eight seven at Z Display style Z equals eighty eight degrees gives r e y a t m display style r underscore mathrm e y underscore mathrm a t m approximately equals 631.01 and x h o R I Z display style x underscore mathrm Horus approximately equals thirty five point five four with the same value for R E display style R underscore mathrm E as above Y a T M Display style Y underscore Mathem ATM 
approximately equals 10096 meters. While a homogeneous atmosphere isn't a physically realistic model, the approximation is reasonable. As long as the scale height of the atmosphere is small compared to the radius of the planet, the model is usable, i.e., it does not diverge or go to zero at all zenith angles, including those greater than 90 degrees. See homogeneous spherical atmosphere with elevated observer below. The model requires comparatively little computational overhead, and if high accuracy is not required, it gives reasonable results. However, for zenith angles less than 90 degrees, a better fit to accepted values of air mass can be had with several of the interpolative formulas. Variable density atmosphere In a real atmosphere, density decreases with elevation above mean sea level. The absolute air mass sigma then is sigma equals rho d S display style sigma equals int rho mathrm d s for the geometrical light path discussed above this becomes for a sea level observer sigma equals 0 y a t m rho r E plus Y D Y R E two cos two Z plus two R E Y plus Y two Display style Sigma equals int underscore zero carrot Y underscore mathem ATM FRAC row left R underscore mathem E plus Y right mathem D Y SQRT R underscore mathem E carrot two cos carrot two Z plus two R underscore mathem E Y plus Y carrot two the relative air mass then is x equals sigma sigma z e n display style x equals frac sigma sigma underscore mathrm zen the absolute air mass at zenith sigma Z E N display style sigma underscore mathrm zen is also known as the column density. Topic: Isothermal atmosphere. Several basic models for density variation with elevation are commonly used. The simplest, an isothermal atmosphere, gives rho equals rho zero e minus y h. Display style rho equals rho underscore zero e caret y h, where rho zero display style rho underscore zero is the sea level density and h display style h is 
the pressure scale height. When the limits of integration are zero and infinity, and some high order terms are dropped, this model yields Young 1974, 147 x approximately equals pi r 2 h exp r cos 2 z 2 h e R F C R cos two Z two H Display style x approximately sqrt frac pi r 2 h exp left frac r cos caret 2 z 2 h right mathrm erfc left sqrt frac r cos caret 2 z 2 h right An approximate correction for refraction can be made by taking Young 1974, 147 R equals 7 6 R E Display style R equals 7 6 R underscore Mathem E where R E Display style r underscore mathrm e is the physical radius of the Earth. At the horizon, the approximate equation becomes x h o r i z approximately equals pi r. 2 h display style x underscore mathrm horas approximately sqrt frac pi r 2 h using a scale height of 8,435 meters, Earth's mean radius of 6,371 kilometers, and including the correction for refraction x. H O R I Z approximately equals thirty seven point two zero Display style x underscore mathem Horace approximately thirty seven point two zero Topic Polytropic atmosphere The assumption of constant temperature is simplistic, a more realistic model is the polytropic atmosphere, for which T equals T zero minus alpha Y Display style t equals t underscore zero alpha y, where t zero display style t underscore zero is the sea level temperature and alpha display style alpha is the temperature lapse rate. The density as a function of elevation is rho equals rho 0 1 minus alpha t 0 y 1 kappa minus 1 
Display style row equals row underscore zero left one FRAC alpha T underscore zero Y right carrot one kappa minus one where kappa display style kappa is the polytropic exponent or polytropic index the air mass integral for the polytropic model does not lend itself to a closed form solution except at the zenith so the integration usually is performed numerically topic Compound atmosphere Earth's atmosphere consists of multiple layers with different temperature and density characteristics. Common atmospheric models include the International Standard Atmosphere and the U.S. Standard Atmosphere. A good approximation for many purposes is a Polytropic troposphere of 11 km height with a lapse rate of 6.5 K per km and an isothermal stratosphere of infinite height Garfinkel 1967, which corresponds very closely to the first two layers of the International Standard Atmosphere. More Layers can be used if greater accuracy is required. Topic: <inaudible> Refracting radially symmetrical atmosphere. When atmospheric refraction is considered, the absolute air mass integral becomes sigma equals r o B S R A T M Rho D R one minus N O B S N R O B S R two sin two Z Display style sigma equals int underscore R underscore mathem OBS carrot R underscore mathem ATM FRAC row mathem D R S Q R T one left FRAC N underscore mathem OBS N FRAC R underscore Mathem OBS R right carrot two sin carrot two Z where n o b s display style n underscore mathrm obs is the index of refraction of air at the observer's elevation y o b s Display style y underscore mathrm obs above sea level n display style n is the index of refraction at elevation y display style y above sea level r o b s equals r e plus y o b s display style r underscore mathrm obs equals r underscore mathrm e plus y underscore mathrm obs r equals r E plus Y 
Display style R equals R underscore Mathem E plus Y is the distance from the center of the Earth to a point at elevation Y Display style Y and R A T M equals R E plus Y A T M Display style R underscore Mathem ATM equals R underscore Mathem E plus Y underscore Mathem ATM is distance to the upper limit of the atmosphere at elevation Y A T M Display style Y underscore Mathem ATM the index of refraction in terms of density is usually given to sufficient accuracy. Garfinkel 1967 by the Gladstone-Dale relation n minus 1 n o b s minus 1 equals rho rho o b s display style frac n1 n underscore mathrm obs minus 1 equals frac rho rho underscore mathrm obs rearrangement and substitution into the absolute air mass integral Gives sigma equals R O B S R A T M Rho D R one minus N O B S one plus N O B S minus one row row O B S two R O B S R two Sin two Z Display style sigma equals int underscore r underscore mathrm obs caret r underscore mathrm atm frac row mathrm dr sqrt one left frac n underscore mathrm obs one plus n underscore mathrm obs minus one row row underscore mathrm obs right caret two left frac R A C R underscore Mathem O B S R right carrot two sin carrot two Z The quantity N O B S minus one Display style N underscore Mathem O B S minus one is quite small, expanding the first term in parentheses, rearranging several times, and ignoring terms in N O B S minus one two Display style N underscore Mathem O B S minus one carrot two after each rearrangement gives K 
Caston and Young 1989 Sigma R O B S R A T M Rho D R one minus one plus two N O B S minus one one minus Rho Rho O B S R O B S R two Sin two Z Display style sigma equals int underscore r underscore mathrm obs caret r underscore mathrm atm frac row mathrm dr sqrt one left one plus two n underscore mathrm obs minus one one frac row row underscore mathrm obs right left frac r underscore mathrm OBS R right carrot two sin carrot two Z Topic Homogeneous spherical atmosphere with elevated observer In the figure at right, an observer at O is at an elevation Y O B S display style y underscore mathrm obs above sea level in a uniform radially symmetrical atmosphere of height y a t m display style y underscore mathrm atm the path length of a light ray at zenith angle Z display style Z is S display style S R E display style R underscore mathrm E is the radius of the Earth. Applying the law of cosines to triangle OAC R E plus y a t m 2 equals s 2 plus r e plus y o b s 2 minus 2 r e plus y o b s s cuz 180 minus Z equals S two plus R E plus Y O B S two plus two R E plus Y O B S S cos Z display style begin aligned left R underscore E plus Y underscore ATM right carrot two and equals S carrot two plus left R underscore E plus Y underscore O B S right carrot two minus 
minus two left R underscore E plus Y underscore OBS right S cos left one hundred eighty carat circ Z right and equals S carat two plus left R underscore E plus Y underscore OBS right carat two plus two left R underscore E plus Y underscore OBS right S cos Z end aligned expanding the left and right hand sides eliminating the common terms and rearranging gives s 2 plus 2 r e plus y obs s cuz z minus 2 r e y atm minus y atm 2 plus 2 r e y obs plus y obs 2 equals 0 Display style S carrot two plus two left R underscore text E plus Y underscore text OBS right S cos Z two R underscore text E Y underscore text ATM Y underscore text ATM carrot two plus two R underscore text E Y underscore text OBS plus Y underscore Text OBS carrot two equals zero. Solving the quadratic for the path length S, factoring and rearranging S equals plus or minus R E plus Y OBS two cos Two Z plus two R E Y ATM minus Y OBS plus Y ATM two minus Y OBS two minus R E plus Y OBS cos Z Display style S equals PM SQRT left R underscore text E plus Y underscore text OBS right carrot two cos carrot two Z plus two R underscore text E left Y underscore text ATM Y underscore text OBS right plus Y underscore text ATM carrot two Y underscore Text OBS carrot two R underscore text E plus Y underscore text OBS cos Z. The negative sign of the radical gives a negative result, which is not physically meaningful. Using the positive sign, dividing by Y A T M Display style y underscore mathrm atm and cancelling common terms and rearranging gives the relative air mass x equals r e plus y obs y atm two Cause 
2 z plus 2 r e y atm 2 y atm minus y obs minus y obs y atm 2 plus 1 minus r e plus y obs y atm cuz z Display style x equals sqrt left frac r underscore text e plus y underscore text obs y underscore text atm right caret two cos caret two z plus frac two r underscore text e y underscore text atm caret two left y underscore text atm Y underscore text OBS right left FRAC Y underscore text OBS Y underscore text ATM right carrot two plus one FRAC R underscore text E plus Y underscore text OBS Y underscore text ATM cos Z with the substitutions R carrot equals R E Y A T M display style hat R equals R underscore mathem E Y underscore mathem A T M and Y carrot equals y o b s y a t m display style hat y equals y underscore mathrm o b s y underscore mathrm a t m this can be given as x equals R carrot plus Y carrot two cos two Z plus two R carrot one minus Y Carrot minus Y carrot two plus one minus R carrot plus Y carrot cos Z Display style x equals sqrt hat r plus hat y carrot two cos carrot two z plus two hat r one hat y hat y carrot two plus one hat r plus hat y cos z. When the observer's elevation is zero, the air mass equation simplifies to x equals R E Y A T M two cos two Z plus two R E Y A T M plus one minus r 
E Y A T M cos Z Display style x equals sqrt left frac r underscore text e y underscore text atm right caret two cos caret two z plus frac two r underscore text e y underscore text atm plus one frac r underscore text e y underscore text atm cos Z maximum zenith angle when the observer is at an elevation greater than that of the horizon the zenith angle can be greater than 90 degrees the maximum possible zenith angle occurs when the ray is tangent to earth's surface from triangle ocg in the figure at right cuz gamma equals R E plus Y OBS minus H R E plus Y OBS Display style cos gamma equals frac r underscore text e plus y underscore text obs h r underscore text e plus y underscore text obs where h display style h is the observer's height above the horizon. The geometrical dip of the horizon. Gamma display style gamma is related to Z M A X display style Z underscore mathrm max by gamma equals Z max minus Ninety. Display style gamma equals z underscore text max minus ninety caret cert. So that cos gamma equals cos z max minus ninety equals sin. Z max display style cos gamma equals cos left Z underscore text max minus ninety caret circ right equals sin Z underscore text max. Then sin Z max equals R E plus y obs minus h r e plus y obs Display style sin z underscore text max equals frac r underscore text e plus y underscore text obs h r underscore text e plus y underscore text obs for a non-negative height h display style h the angle z M A X display style z underscore mathrm max is always ninety degrees. However, the inverse sine functions provided by most calculators and programming languages return values in the range plus or minus ninety degrees. The value can be placed in the proper quadrant by z. Max equals one hundred eighty minus sin 
minus one R E plus Y OBS minus H R E plus Y OBS Display style Z underscore text max equals one hundred eighty carrot circ sin carrot minus one FRAC R underscore text E plus Y underscore text OBS H R underscore text E plus Y underscore text OBS If the horizon is at sea level Y O B S equals H display style Y underscore mathem O B S equals H, and this simplifies to Z max equals 180 minus sin minus 1 r e r e plus h Display style Z underscore text max equals one hundred eighty carrot circ sin carrot minus one FRAC R underscore text E R underscore text E plus H Topic Non uniform distribution of attenuating species Atmospheric models that derive from hydrostatic considerations Assume an atmosphere of constant composition and a single mechanism of extinction, which isn't quite correct. There are three main sources of attenuation Hayes and Latham 1975 Rayleigh scattering by air molecules, Mie scattering by aerosols and molecular absorption primarily by ozone the relative contribution of each source varies with elevation above sea level and the concentrations of aerosols and ozone cannot be derived simply from hydrostatic considerations rigorously when the extinction coefficient depends on elevation it must be determined as part of the air mass integral, as described by Thomason, Herman, and Reagan 1983. A compromise approach often is possible, however. Methods for separately calculating the extinction from each species using closed form expressions are described in Schaefer 1993 and Schaefer 1998 The latter reference includes source code for a basic program to perform the calculations Reasonably accurate calculation of extinction can sometimes be done by using one of the simple air mass formulas and separately Determining extinction coefficients for each of the attenuating species Green 1992, Pickering 2002 <inaudible> <inaudible> Air mass and astronomy In optical astronomy the air mass provides an indication of the deterioration of the observed image, not only as regards direct effects of spectral absorption, scattering and reduced brightness, but also an aggregation of visual aberrations, e.g. resulting from atmospheric turbulence, collectively referred to as the quality of the seeing. 
on bigger telescopes, such as the WHT Win and Warsak 1988 and VLT Avila, Ruprecht, and Becker 1997, the atmospheric dispersion can be so severe that it affects the pointing of the telescope to the target. In such cases an atmospheric dispersion compensator is used, which usually consists of two prisms. The Greenwood frequency and Fried parameter, both relevant for adaptive optics, depend on the air mass above them or more specifically, on the zenith angle. In radio astronomy the air mass which influences the optical path length is not relevant. The lower layers of the atmosphere, modeled by the air mass, do not significantly impede radio waves, which are of much lower frequency than optical waves. Instead, some radio waves are affected by the ionosphere in the upper atmosphere. Newer aperture synthesis radio telescopes are especially affected by this as they see a much larger portion of the sky and thus the ionosphere. In fact, LOFAR needs to explicitly calibrate for these distorting effects. Van der Tal and Van der Veen 2007, De Vos, Gunst, and Nyboer 2009, but on the other hand can also study the ionosphere by instead measuring these distortions. Thide 2007. Topic Air mass and solar energy Atmospheric attenuation of solar radiation is not the same for all wavelengths, consequently, passage through the atmosphere not only reduces intensity but also alters the spectral irradiance. Photovoltaic modules are commonly rated using spectral irradiance for an air mass of 1.5 AM 1.5. Tables of these standard spectra are given in ASTM G17303. The extraterrestrial spectral irradiance i.e. that for AM0 is given in ASTM E490 a for many solar energy applications when high accuracy near the horizon is not required air mass is commonly determined using the simple secant formula described in the section plane parallel atmosphere Topic. See also. Equals equals notes. <laughs>